Hello everybody and welcome back to Provis Gaming and more EU for the Big Blue Blob playing as France. We are at war with England, it's official. Castile's gonna go and kill these guys, these guys- oh, England is stocking up on some troops, are they? Well that scares me a little bit. Let's back up, um, actually we can reinforce directly so I think we're okay. We just need to win this first big fight. Absolutely critical. Um... Let's make the nobility happy because I think I am more likely to have to get some manpower from them than anyone else. So I'm okay with that. Clergy are upset because they don't have enough land. When the heck did that happen? Hang on. Um, let's take a quick look at the development. Something cheaper-ish. Eight, nine... Nothing really easy I can hand off, nothing super cheap. Alright, give this to the clergy. There we go. Okay. Yeah, please take this fort, and if we can win this first big fight here against England, that would be amazing. He's going to have a lot of mercs. Actually might be a good opportunity for me to merc up as well. Um, and that's what we're going to do, and we are going to take a loan. And train up even more. We're going to go way over our force limit and cost myself a ton of money, but this is the big war. If we can win this, I think we have a good chance of just winning this in the achievement. So let's get some extra reinforcements so I can have a numbers advantage over him. Try to get mercs in the front line. Um, we managed to break through. Good. Still got 30,000 troops. I'm going to have about 40. Come on, take it. Good God! I don't know why things are always so difficult. All right, the Karelian Separatists, not very likely to fire. Same with these guys over here. Novgorod up there is going to be a bit of a problem, but oh well. We'll deal with them in due time. Now we'll request family aid. Uh, Money is money, I guess. Come on! For the love of God! Why does it have to be so hard? We lost the Siege of Anjou. Uh, of course, because Castile freaking left. Great. So I just lost that fort for no good reason. There we go. Pile on York. Farmlands. This is it. Savoy called for a crusade against Tunis. Ooh, big fight. Big fight. Okay. We win, but we lost a lot of men. He's probably going to London. Let's see if we can stack wipe him. Oh, there goes Naples. Not a stack wipe. Inspirational leader. Fun. You're going to go all the way over here, maybe? Nope. North. Catch him. Okay, that's some. Catch him. Come on. I need to shatter this. Get him. Get him. Get him. Okay. Not a stack wipe, but still a lot dead. Come on. Profiteering in something that I don't care about. Um. Sure. He's in Norfolk. Nope, he's going here. We can catch him, though. We have two spe split up armies. Okay. That's a stack wipe. Okay, huge. Huge! Go over here next. Get him. Get him. That's it! Okay! We have stack wiped everything. The chat all mercs. Go home. We're not going to pay for any of you anymore. Uh, Castile's already going to this fort, which is fine. Uh, the only real forts left then are London. I'm going to go ahead and do some carpet sieging so he is less likely to get reinforcements. Take all of you. You're going to go here, 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 and here. All right. That was it. That's the war we were looking for. There's the siege of Le Bourg. Done. Let's go and... Where is Utrecht? Looks like they're already getting sieged down. They're doing nothing really about Portugal. Can I piece you out now? Yes, actually, I can totally peace out Portugal. Um, you don't have anything I care about, I think. Yeah, you're way too high in development to be worth my time. We'll take your money. Whatever I can. 300 ducats isn't bad. Knock out Portugal. Okay. This army, we are already sieging down Utrecht, so go to Anjou and start sieging that back because reasons. We'll do this carpet siege. You guys, I'm going to disband so we don't have to pay for you anymore. Yeah, I'm very glad I murked up. Uh, that was absolutely the right choice. That fi first fight was a little bit close. You are at war with Tunis. You may absolutely have uh, military access if you want. 
Okay, he's trying to train up some troops, but uh, I think I am greatly restricting how many he can get. Let's see if I can catch a couple out. Not easily, but I think I can trap him in Cornwall. Whoa, 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 where do you get another 11,000 troops? Never mind. Okay, never mind, never mind. You assist over here, and then go to Essex. So this is an easy squish. Um, he is coming after me now. Reinforce. Okay, we are we are fighting. He'll have a load of mercs now. But I think with Castile's help, this is still going to be fine. We are indeed going to shatter his army again. He's going to go to Dorset to start, and that's where he's stopping. Okay, kill him. Got 2,000 more. Go to Oxford. It's not going to be a stack white, but it's doing a lot. Go down to Somerset. Go to Cornwall. It's not going to be enough to stack wipe him. I rolled pretty well there, but no, we're way too low on reinforcements. Okay, you guys need to go over here. See if you can help. Um, appears to be going this way. Um, can we get to Gwynedd and kill him real quick? Kind of. We won the Siege of Anjou already. We lost the Siege of Maine somehow. We'll fix that. Uh, all of you guys get to Gwynedd. He's going to try to run away, but we should have reinforcements. And he's not stack wiped again. Speed four, please. Okay, where's he going? Shrewsbury to start. And then... Here. He's probably going to go all the way back to Cornwall, if I had to guess. Nope. I am wrong. Castile, help me. There we go. All right. Another one. Split, split, split. Go here. 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 And you other ones stay there. He can't train at very many reinforcements at this point. We should have we should have grossly uh, weakened his ability to do so. Um, we can't afford to get another stability because I have too much admin power. And I don't see a reason to get the tech. But I do see a reason to get stability. So we're going to do that. Does that put down the Corellians? Not entirely. Um, to make sure that this doesn't become a problem, I think I'm going to have to harsh treatment you. Put that down. Um, okay, we are now in a position where Novgorod is in a pos trying to get uh, independence. And if we do not send some troops up there, we may lose them. How many re uh, rebels are there? Where'd they go? I have no idea. Transport troops up there. Hopefully, uh, the Papal State can deal with Utrecht. Let's go ahead and turn this fort on. Get a reinforcement. They're not going to be able to go much of anywhere. All right. Yeah, I uh, do not want to have independence for Novgorod. That would undo quite a bit of work. Obviously, that would annoy me. Significantly. We are at 96% war score with England right now if we stop. We don't even have London under control. Can I get Utrecht out of the war? Actually, yes. Now, here's the fun thing. If I took the land, I could totally core that, but it would be Roman Empire land, so it's not worth it to me. We'll take your war reps. I don't care about all these alliances, so you're done. Okay. Now, if I wanted to peace out with you, we will first off absolutely take my land... Take some stuff we have cores on, or claims on. We can get down to Chester. Man is cheap. If we could get Cornwall, that would be cheap. Uh, we can take a lot of land. Coalition scares me a little bit. We could take all of this, though. 97, right there. And a little bit of money to boot. Now, here's the thing. How much overextension is that? 43. Currently, I have 34. I could do that. This is worth it right now. 
All right, we are done with England. Wait! They're still guaranteeing the independence of Brittany. If I hop into another war with them right now and call in Burgundy, I can't. Uh, you're not in a war right now. England can't join right now. Yeah. Um, I wasn't aware of that 30-month uh, mechanic. How long has this war been going? I think we could probably still do this. We will try to chain this into a war immediately. This is almost certainly going to lead to a coalition in Europe, but as long as it doesn't fire, we'll be okay. How many provinces am I taking out of this? Let me do some math real quick. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11 more provinces. So 76, 77, 78, 79... 80, 81, 82, 83. By 1474. That's not bad. Plus an extra five. And then we're just a few provinces away. We're like one good war against Muscovy away from winning. If we do that. I could also take provinces from Scotland since I have the power. Uh, one war with Denmark would solve it as well. All right. Are there other reasons you won't join? Let me just check this. Already at war with France. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, we could just hopscotch into another war with England immediately, but I don't I don't know if I see the point. It's just going to make things harder for really no reason. All right, we're going to try it. We're going to go for Rene. Uh, if I co belligerize Scotland, what happens? We fight Friesland. I don't have any claims on their land. I don't think I I don't think I care. All right, here goes. Declare another war. And then if we peace out with England, you do not immediately join, do you? I'm willing to give up the money. You're out. Okay. Hey, achievement. Azur Seme del Ilor. Or whatever that says. Um, mission fulfilled. Conquer Gascony. Ah, yes. Conquer Provence. Hmm. Could invest in an idea that would get me diplomatic relations. Don't think that I care. Core all of this. The clergy are apparently in... Uh, nope, they're going down. We're fine. Let's pay off the war exhaustion. Um, yeah. Now we just need to go to war with Brittany. Okay. Some of you guys go up here so that we'll be able to go kill um, Scotland. Not that they have much, but still. You are in an awkward spot. Why don't you run for a minute? Go to Co. That should be safe. Nothing else I can core at the moment. Okay. I'm a little concerned about coalitions. A little bit. Uh, end of the Hundred Years' War. Sweet. Power. That's what I like to see. Okay, you guys are fine. Um, my transports are currently taking troops up. Go ahead and drop them off. Okay. Go down here. Uh, I'm very low on manpower. Can I get some more? Bourgeoisie are upset at me, but that's alright. Um, I need to transport some troops over so I can go kill Brittany real quick. It's kind of important. I can call in the Papal State. I guess I will. Alright. Might as well have an extra friend. Go fight Savoy. Um, yeah, I actually forgot about Savoy. I'm not actually that worried about Scotland right now. They're about to get broken by the uh, Scottish noble rebels. Core the rest of these. You guys are going to start marching over here. 
Independence for Novgorod. They are 49% of the way toward enforcing their demands. England has allied Helra. Doesn't matter. They are sieging down Paris currently. Yeah. Um, I am going to go ahead and raise the autonomy in all these provinces, because they do not matter, and I don't want to have to deal with English unrest. So let's greatly reduce that. Isle of Man, same deal. Okay, all that's looking good. Alrighty. Um, there's a lot more troops down here than I was expecting. There's a lot more troops here than I was expecting. And I died. Okay, Queen Regency. I'm out of manpower, though. Now, here's something I can do. I could start burning some of my development to get manpower, and I'm going to. It doesn't matter, because uh, this game's not going to last that much longer anyway. I'd rather... Well, that's not much manpower at all. Uh, I guess it's autonomy-based, in part. That's not a lot of manpower. Here's some. 800. Yeah, we don't care if I am in the best economic position by the end of this. We're just trying to win this uh, this achievement. That's all we care about. That's not a lot either. All right, Papal State, thank you. You're going to go kill Brittany for me. That's great. Uh, lots of naval battles. Why don't you go over here? We got some reinforcements being delivered right now. Group up. I really want to be able to call you in, but you would not accept because you're cruel. A cruel ruler, huh? Who'd have thunk? I didn't expect that to be a problem. All right, reinforcements are coming in. Denmark has also allied Helra. That's funny. Uh, let's get these troops together. We have just enough manpower that we're starting to reinforce up to our numbers. Let's see. Take a loan. Get some mercs. You guys, transfer. I need some more bodies here in the front line that are not going to lose my manpower, basically. That's what it comes down to. Now, if I try to break the Siege of Paris right now, I think we'll be in trouble. I forgot we got an extra 50 tradition uh, general at the very end of the last video. Pick this guy up. These guys could use a general up here. Make him move faster, take less attrition. Royal marriage with Castile. Sure, did you get an heir? You did not. A Davaloy did take over. We didn't get a personal union, but a Davaloy is on the throne. That's fun. Under other circumstances, uh, I could try to claim the throne, but as is, no. All right, let's see. I need manpower. 625. 400. 750. Thank you. Mm, 181. It adds up a little bit. I'm not going to make a push on them immediately, though. We will wait until my reinforcements have arrived, simply because I'd rather have the overwhelming numbers and not worry about it. All right, now we're going to go break these guys. Scotland, your troops are going to die. Flee from me. Squish. Reinforcements are not going to defend you. Okay. Uh, let's see. I can go to Paris next. We'll have to fight a fair number if I do. Can I sneak around and kill? Yes. Let's sneak around this way and try to force him to break the siege that way. I'd rather take on the big army right here. Can I... Call? No, I can't core anything else. We could go for another stability. Don't see the point. We're about to finish annexing our vassal, by the way. Okay, we are going to fight. I would have thought that my shock value would do better than that. Oh, lord. Retreat. That just lost me way more men than I can handle. Not good. I'm going to have to sabotage everything. Oh, I accidentally just... Just spent power getting that. Didn't mean to. 
I'm gonna take everything. 60? Wasn't worth it. 750, there you go. Okay. There's probably a button to make that faster now that I think about it. Okay, um... I still would have thought that this number's advantage is highly in my favor, but apparently not. Let's go s just start getting a ticking war score here. We have indeed annexed our vassal. Good. Go kill these guys. We are going to quickly grab these forts, I hope. You are going to blockade to make it faster. Um... We managed to siege that back. Okay. Sure. You may have that military access. I'm okay with that. Nothing else I can core at the moment. And unfortunately, we're kind of out of time. That was a huge fight to lose. I was not expecting that. I really wasn't. All right. Well, yeah, we have to end the video here. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and full occupy Brittany real quick. The Papal State is doing their thing. Um, we're going to give ourselves a second to kind of reinforce the best I can. We have entered the stage of the game where I think that I am going to have to start uh, murking up and going heavily into debt in order to have a good chance at making this work. I am going to probably fire this advisor because I don't think it's worth spending the money on that anymore. But yeah. All right. Thank you all very much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If so, then be sure to hit that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys next time.